Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Everett, Washington, with a uh, relatively new frauditor whose channel name goes by a pig's daughter. You know what? If you're from Everett, have you met Glenn Serio, I wonder? Because, well, he's from Everett, too. But you know what? He's been living out of airports throughout the country recently, so I have no idea if he's in your area or not anymore. But at any rate, in this particular video, she ends up getting arrested for obstruction and says that obstruction is a physical act. Well, what else is new with these frauditors? They don't know what obstruction is. So at any rate, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. You know, uh, she just spends a good portion of this video just sitting here watching that cop do his job until she decides to walk up and interfere with his investigation. So let's go ahead and fast forward to that part right there, shall we? That's much too early. Prepare to fast forward. Preparing to fast forward. Fast forward. Fast forwarding, sir. Obstruction requires a physical act. Oh boy, aren't you the stupid one right here? Obstruction does not require a physical act. For instance, if you take the attention away from an officer who's doing his job at a traffic stop by calling him names and everything like that, and he has to draw his attention away from something that might be a serious situation, then you could possibly be endangering the officer which then becomes obstruction, you dumbass. And that has been known to happen quite a number of times. But you're just too damn pig ignorant to figure that out. You're physically obstructing me. No, I'm not. I cannot continue my investigation with you coming up to my car. Call your sergeant. I want to speak to your... <laughs> Got a scaredy pig. Please step away, ma'am. I am away. 
You can stand over there on the curb. There is no distance and you don't have tape up. The there curb. is no tape up. What is this obsession with tape that you frauditors have? Even if it's up, you're still going to cause an issue. You're just going to say it's unconstitutional or something like that. It's still one of those situations where you're going to find something wrong with it. It's kind of like you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't anyway. But let's carry on. I don't have a cover. You can stand over You're there. You're fine. I ain't going to hurt you. Not even armed. Yes, you are. You got a knife. Behind your back. Call your sergeant. Sorry. I'll take cover. Let me put this out. I'm trying to put the thing put, out. You can put it on the ground. I don't put it on it. the ground or I'll put you on the ground. Just Ma'am, stop. Just a fucking minute, please. Let me. Thank you. Call your sergeant. Well, you have Leave a deputy chief coming here. Drop it. Okay, you can set this down now. No. You're not let. Breaking the property. Breaking the law right now. Good thing the deputy chief is my cover. Mm -hmm. You can talk to him. Well, now, stupid is as stupid does. She followed the four auditor script and ended up getting a shiny new pair of bracelets for her trouble. Bravo, dumbass. Bravo. Well, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.